gotten all but one of their seven shots in the second quarter to drop. Pretty impressive. Deflects the pass. And Cousins kicks to Harden. Screen by Cousins. For the three. And James Harden with the three. Harden's got 13. Beautiful pick by the big man, Cousins. Gotten just over 50% of their shots to drop here in the second quarter. They're five for nine. They set the screen. It was red hot. And they get some nice contributions from him on a nightly basis as he averages over 11 points a game. It's Harden with the drive. That one is good again. He's six for eight from the floor with the basket. That's a precision shot. You've got to be precise. No room for error on the floater. Passes it to B. P passes to Yao. Nice D from Cousins. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one, Greg. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. You know, when you look at DeMarcus Cousins, he's clearly one of the more talented and also one of the most emotional players in the game. He's also one of the most teed up. Oh, good on that one. We're talking about Cousins' top five and technical fouls in each of his first five seasons. Among other things, that's given away a ton of free points, guys, to the opposition. Yeah, De DeMarcus is working hard to control that temper, and he knows it's important for the team. But it's hard to, to plug a volcano. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, I tell you what, guys, he's an extremely strong finisher. I'm surprised he wasn't able to power that through the defense. Dishes it to Yao, and the pass to B. The feed to Yao. Pass to Red Hot. Shoots the three. Can't get it to go. Evans with some nice deep. Unfortunately, that's been the result for him over and over, guys. He just cannot find the bottom of the basket. Love outside. Inside. Here's Towns. That's in there. Love with the assist. They have repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys. And it's paid dividends. And with as many points as they've gotten in the paint, you know, they haven't had to do much work on the perimeter. Passes it to Red Hot. To the wing right side. They set the pick. B the pass to Red Hot. Lock at six. They need this one. Misses that one. He's made one and missed two this game so far. Here's the quick. Taking a look at his stats, he's averaging around nine and a half points a game. Let out the pass to Yao. Great pass to set up the lay-in. The quick's got five now. Hard to get that one off with the size difference there. That makes it a tough individual matchup for him, especially down low. Well, took on the big guys going in there and challenging them like he did. But boy, that was a nice job. Team ball. D, he's checked in for D. Timeout call. Yeah, can't be pleased with all these easy looks. They continue to give up there in the paint. No, I'm sure he's not, Greg. I mean, their defense is showing a lot of holes, especially down low. That's unacceptable. Yao, the pass to B. To the right side. Picked by Yao. Now the pass to B. D, he's guarded by Love. Go ahead and just hammer it home, why don't you? He might not be the athlete that some of the other big men are in this league, but my goodness, he still knows how to finish. Well, he doesn't count on elevation or hang time, that's for sure, but he can still get it in the basket. And here's Anthony for three. That ball's off target. It's his third miss. He's made two shots from the field. B, the pass to Yao. Inside and stolen by Love. And here we go with Anthony running it up the court. Got a piece of it. 
We've got 123 left in the first half of basketball. No hesitation at all right there. Just right up against a much bigger defender. Man, and I love that fearlessness, that aggressive attitude. Boy, I love watching guys play with that kind of abandon and freedom, Greg. It's a beautiful thing, man. Pass to the quick. Here's B. Bounces high off the rim and drops. B's got his second bucket of the night. And that's another assist for a team that is putting on the clinic on how to share the ball. And I love the mentality that they've had. If a shot isn't there, they're not forcing it. They're moving it side to side until they finally get the one they want. I really think that's the area they want to work the ball into, and it takes passing like that to get it done. 46 seconds left here in the second. Passes to D. Here's Hugh. It's rebounded by Towns. I can't figure out, guys, what's going on with him this quarter. I mean, he hasn't gotten one shot to drop. And I like how he puts himself in position there to finish on the break. Yeah, you know, that's what we call seeing and feeling the game. Excellent read of how that play was going to develop and where the ball was going. That's stuff that you oftentimes can't teach, Greg. Picked by Yao. Over to the left wing. Just five on the clock. Here's B. Banked in off the glass. B's got four this quarter. Textbook. Nice pass. Great catch. Even better finish. And Thomas, here we go to the paint. It's tipped and stolen by Yao. So as we conclude the first half, so far fairly one-sided. The away team delivering the blowout. And time now to go courtside as we send you over to Doris Burke from the sideline. Doris? Well, DeMarcus, certainly a well-played first half by this team. Tell us about how the discipline and regimen has helped this group get its focus. We, we've actually been uh, practicing what we're preaching now, so it's carrying over into the game. And, I mean, we've been doing that so far, and we, we've been pretty good so far. Well done, DeMarcus. Thanks for the time. Guys? Thank you.